Hey everybody, Poppy here. I am super excited. This is kind of the last part in like a super mini series. Um, basically, if you watched my Pegatrix collection video, I talked about the fact that I didn't have Ventus Pegatrix Ultra or Darkest Pegatrix Ultra. My last video, most recent one, was me unboxing the Ventus Pegatrix Ultra 3 pack. And today, the wait is finally over. Look at this spicy, spicy gear pack. So I'm really, really happy. Um, this is the one that I've been waiting on the most, is the Darkest Pegatrix Ultra. We didn't get a Darkest Pegatrix Ultra last year. Um, she is obviously not the main component of this pack. This is the Pyrus Trox Ultra Baku Gear 4 pack. Um, the main thing to note here is that mm, these are supposed to have a translucent Bakugan in them. However, this one clearly does not. Uh, the Pyrus Trox in this has been like advertised as being a translucent Pyrus, which means it kind of looks like a ruby kind of version of it. Um, but this one is solid. Apparently the earlier versions of these packs uh, were conceptualized and some of them created before they decided to go through with the translucents. Um, so this is obviously one of the earliest uh, created ones. I ordered this one off of Amazon. Uh, I didn't really have the expectation of it being translucent necessarily because we'd already kind of seen some people finding ones that weren't translucent. Um, but it would have been nice if it was, but it's not, but that's okay because I'm mostly in it for the Pegatrix anyway. Um, but you know, things happen. It's fine. It's all good. Uh, I'm just gonna snip it on open. I'm gonna tear into this tape. Oh gosh. Hi. Hello. Layla. Why did she do that? I don't know. She's rubbing the... <laughs> just keep opening it. Okay. She doesn't um, usually do that when we're when we're doing stuff out here. She usually stays off the table. She still interrupts everything. Oh yeah, absolutely. Um, she somehow didn't make it into the last video. That's a miracle. I think she was asleep. Let's see if I can open this. I'm gonna pull it open. First things first is the card pack. I almost always open the little cards. The cores are actually in here. Snippy, snippy, snippy. Oh, oh, that's just fun. The cores even came in their own little, 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 little packaging. That's nifty. So the cores that it comes with are, um, here's a Helix. It's a minus 100B, uh, minus three damage trap core. Um, Okay, that's fine. Uh, there was one of these in the last pack that I opened. Cool. A plus two damage green fist. A, an, oh, another Pyrus Darkest plus 400B shield. These are nice, um, especially if you like running Pyrus and Darkest like me. Uh, these are, these are good. These are good ones to have. A plus 200b plus three damage minus two gear cost fire fist it's good to get those gear reductions in there if you're going to play gear which baku gear is really nice in the game to use uh a plus 300 minus one gear cost shield a plus two damage minus two gear cost uh green fist the big boy. The big boy. This is the one everyone is going to be running um, if they have a green fist in their deck, and then they, if they also use Baku gear, which it is highly recommended to do. Um, this gives you a small damage boost, but it also reduces, you know, two cost off of your gear, and that is great because, like, especially if you're running like a four cost gear, then it's half. If you're running a two cost gear, it's free. Let's see, we also have a plus two fifty B minus one gear cost um, shield and a plus three damage green fist, so. Um, a mix of cores, most of them are okay. Uh, two of the really good ones in there, so that's nice. We'll go ahead and put those over to the side. These are little pieces of paper, you can just... I don't, I hope nobody hates me for that. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Spin Master. So we can take a look at what we've got here. 
Um, we've got the, we'll start off with the Trox Ultra character card. Trox is shield, fire fist, 500B, and three damage, Pyrus Trox Ultra. <laughs> Spicy boy. He's, it's okay. He's fine. Um, the next one, we'll look at the darkest Pegatrix Ultra is shield, green fist. Yay! Uh, 700B and three damage. It's nice to actually have my hands on this one. I've been proxying using um, the Darkest Pegatrix core card and then just like on a piece of paper writing down the actual stats and slipping it in front of it. That's been real. It's been really DIY, I guess. DIY of me. Um, the Chaos Bakugan that comes in this is Centipod. Uh, Centipod, Chaos Centipod is Green Fist, Shield, 400B, and 6 damage. This is fun. It's another Bakugan that's new this year. Kind of a throwback to what Centipoid of the last series. Yeah. Um, but they couldn't get that name, so it's Centipod this time. Um, so that's really, it's gonna be fun to kind of roll him up and see what he looks like. And then finally, we've got Jim. We've got the big boy. We've got the Aquas Bakugan that is just the favorite child this year. He is Helix and Green Fist, 400B and 4 damage with on a Helix plus 500B and plus 5 damage. You roll this guy out onto a plus 600B Helix first turn, and you end up with 1500B first turn. And like almost nobody can match that first turn. So like, oh boy. <laughs> now I've got one. I don't want one. I do. Well, I. I I'm not gonna use it. I'm sorry. I know everyone should be using him, but like, I'm not gonna eat. I don't, Jim sucks. Okay, um, and finally we'll go into the gear cards. This pack comes with four gear cards instead of four action cards, which gear are kind of an action. Anyway, so you attach gear. Um, Pyro Cannon, two cost, plus 100B, plus two damage. Um, the next gear this is the darkest gear, uh, four cost, uh, sorry, the darkest gear is dark daggers, four cost, plus 200B, plus five damage. It's a nifty one. It's okay. It's not bad. Um, yeah. These are all kind of, they're all common gear cards, so you're not gonna find any, like, hexes or anything rare really in here. It's just gonna be all these commons. Uh, Baku Thrusters is the Aquas one. It's four cost, plus 300B, plus three damage. Have like a million of these, I think, already. Thank like, because we found so many AV packs, we've already got a lot of Baku thrusters. And then this is a good one, actually, that people are running. Um, it's a little expensive, but it's Hail Bracers. It's six cost. It's plus one thousand B. Um, I mean, you you get on a Green Fist, and it's four cost effectively. If you have any cards that allow you to grab an extra um, core off of the field, you can attach another green fist. You could effectively reduce this by like four energy uh, to make it cost two. So between two or four for 1000B that just stays there on your Bakugan when you're playing, that's pretty good. That's really, this is a good card to have. It's common, so it's easy to find, but people also really like it. So that's awesome. Really love that. I'm gonna go ahead and put these over here and tear into the pack. We're gonna get out the little fire boy. Little fire guy. I really hate doing this. There we go. Here he is. Um, the Troxes this year just have big feet. They have really big, big stompers. Um, one of his toes isn't out. Hold on, let me pull his toes out. Oh, he's got little, little, little toesies. He's got a little, his little jaw opens. I'm gonna get ya with a big chomper. That's neat. And grab his gear. his little thingies are up here. So you hook the little Trox gear on. Voila. <laughs> so that's really fun. Um, this is like the Pyrus Cutter or whatever it's called. Um, I 
think actually there's another one and then the pirate's cutter is like the second one that's the only one that comes to mind anyway um so the little gear these little things spin on it so it's like a really fun little play pattern to have him with the little little spinning gear he's gonna like cut some lumber or something maybe i don't know maybe he's gonna maybe he wants to be a lumberjack that's fine so we got our little pirate's trucks lumberjack going on over here i'm gonna pop out centipod hello hello let's see where's your magnet there he is that's cool he's a little little bug guy kind of like a, a centipede i guess obviously indicative of the name um he's got his face got like multiple eyes um i said that's fine i mean that's that's what he is um kind of kind of a little creature he really is he's got a nice long body um kind of like it it's a nice little design it's a good design go ahead and lay him down next to his buddy i'm gonna take out jim I think I'm gonna take out Jim kind of sounds like I'm gonna murder him. That's fine. So Jim is what we call uh, the Aquas Hydorus core. I don't remember exactly how that originated. I think one of our locals, Wilder, came up with it, if I remember correctly. Um, Isn't he on Brawler HQ now? Yes! Um, our friend Wilder, who's actually a North Texas Brawler local, uh, he comes to collected comics and games when we meet, when we're not in quarantine. He is um, part of the team over at Brawler HQ, so if you guys want to like go get up to date on stuff that's going on, they're, they're a fantastic brand new group that's kind of rolling things out, telling people about Baku news and everything, and it's really, it's really cool. So it's really glad to see Wilder doing something like that. Um, but yeah, I think calling him Jim was Wilder's idea, and it's fine, it fits. This is Jim. Fifteen hundred B. First turn. Yay. And then finally, the moment we've all been waiting for. The moment I've been waiting for. <laughs> Best day of my life. Darkest Pegatrix Ultra. Oh, her horn's a little hard to come up. There we go. Oh boy, she is so pretty. <sighs> I have reiterated this more than once. I love the Pegatrix Ultra design this year. It's really grown on me. I think it's beautiful. And I am so happy to have my little favorite uh, Darkest Pegatrix in an Ultra form that I absolutely just adore. I am really happy and excited to use her. Hopefully I can find some ways to make her work with her Shield Green Fist 700B2 damage. Um, I'll, I'll figure something out with my deck with her, but I am just elated. She is so cute she's beautiful i want multiples i would love to see her get just like some single like an ultra single pack or something at some point because i want more than one because i would like to customize her um i uh, if it's not obvious i have a thing for like a kind of pinkish rose gold color and i would love to take her and turn her into my little mascot my little buddy my little partner um, so, <laughs> need multiples just in case something happens or goes terribly wrong, um, trial and error. Uh, but yeah, I'm really excited. She is so pretty. So let's go ahead and set each of these little guys out here. That is the Pyrus Trox Ultra gear pack. It comes with these four Bakugan. We have Pyrus Trox Ultra, Darkest Pegatrix Ultra, Chaos Centipod and Aquas Jim. <laughs> Sorry, I can't call him anything else. The name that comes to mind is Jim. I don't think I'm ever going to be able to call him Aquas Hydorus Core ever again. Uh, these are some gorgeous, gorgeous Bakugan. I am so. I have, you know, all of these. I have all of them. I have all of the Pegatrixes. Pe Pegatrix, Pegatri. Somebody said Pegatri. I think it was TCF said that the plural is Pegatri, and so I might just. 
who knows maybe we'll stick with that maybe we won't i maybe we won't so at this point um all the pegatrixes that we have seen like a physical form of existing so far i have this completes my current collection i know that there's going to be an rls core that should be coming out literally very very soon uh and then there's also going to be an aquas um ultra and then there's going to be a translucent pyrus ultra as well for the pegatrix um but those don't those aren't out yet at all so as of today i have all of the pegatrixes that exist and i i'm happy i'm a happy girl i'm a happy pegatrix pal pegatrix fan stan whatever you want to call me queen of the pegatrixes that is that's me and this is this is my little girl and i'm so i'm so happy to have her um yeah, I don't know. I don't have anything else to say. <laughs> um, it was a really quick unboxing. Uh, these are fantastic toys. Um, gosh, I'm, I'm so happy to have this finally. This is, this makes me so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I just think that these are neat. I just think they're so cute. I think they're beautiful. I think they're neat. They're fun. I wish the stats were a little better. <laughs> um, the B power would be fine on her 700b if she had especially if she had like a better core layout instead of shield green fist um if she had even like a boost none of the pegatrixes have like um a, a b buff or anything from their cores this year uh last year a lot of them did and this year none of them do uh so if she had that or even just like a damage boost from a core or something would be a lot better but as of right now she's just 700b um, to damage, you can bust, bust, you can buff that a little bit. It's been a struggle to try to make something work, especially to compete with this guy over here. Um, but we'll figure something out. We'll see what else Fusion Force has in store as that comes out. Uh, we'll see what Shields of Astroia does, introducing a potential new mechanic. I wonder whatever the shield symbol is. Um, I'm just really excited for the future of this game and hoping that things just continue to grow and uh, hoping that a couple of kinks get worked out, um, some things improving, and just... I, I love the game so much and I love I love these toys so much and I just can't wait to see things get even better and more exciting and just a brighter future for Bakugan is the number one thing that I can hope for. Uh, so thank you guys so much for joining me today for this little spicy quick unboxing of my Darkest Pegatrix Ultra and the Pyrus Trox Ultra 4-pack. Um, make sure to like the video, subscribe, maybe ring that little bell icon so you're notified whenever I post new content. I'm trying to produce more stuff more rapidly lately. Uh, feel free to support me on Patreon. There's going to be a link in the description to help me do more of what I really love to do. Uh, my socials will also all be linked as well as on the end screen. Um, and I will see you around. 